This is the question of 2014 measuring paper 3 and the question number is 14. So we have a uniform solid cuboid of dimensions 0 0.50 into 1.20 into 0 0.40. So 1.20 is the height, it is the breadth let us say and it is the thickness and the weight is 4000 Newton and this weight will be acting 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 it will be acting across the across the cg now since it's a 3d figure the cg would be somewhere inside but uh, let me observe from this side if i observe from this side i can say that the cg will be over here so the weight will be acting through this point so from through this point uh, we have this uh, uh, longest side as the vertical as shown here what is the minimum energy required to roll the cuboid? So I have to roll this cuboid such that it becomes like this through 9 degree to the position shown in the diagram 2 with the 0 0.50 meter vertical. So now this thing will become horizontal and this thing will become vertical. So this side becomes this side. This side now turns to this side and this side now turns to this side. So one thing to realize is that if we have to overturn it, we do not need to apply force from here to here. We simply have to apply force till it becomes somewhat like this and later it just rolls on its own. So for that I have drawn this figure here. So this is the figure. Exactly in fact it's the copy of this thing. Copy of this thing. Now if I have to overturn it, what I must do is, I must do like this. Make it fixed do like this 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 and then it will overturn itself so let me repeat that once again it was like this so what i'll do is so from here i will do like this 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 and then it will overturn like this so let me say the position just before it tips over is like this so if so now it's easy will be initially it was like this now its CZ is slightly raised here. This tip is also slightly raised. So this tip is raised by some height from here to here maybe. And the CZ also will rise by some height like this. Some height like this. Now first we have to find by how much height will this tip rise. So this is 1.20 meter. This is 0 0.50 meter. So this is 1.20, 1.50. Now this thing will be, according to Pythagoras theorem, this thing will be 1.30 meters. So this point will be at a height of 1.30 meters at the highest point. So that means this point will be at a height of 0 0.65 meters. And here this point will be at the height of 0 0.60 meters. So this is CZ, the change in height of this CZ is equal to 0 0.65 minus 0 0.60 which is equal to 0 0.05 meters. So now what I can do is the change in potential energy while doing this is equal to mass into G into delta H of the CZ which is equal to weight into delta H equal to 4000 into 0 0.05 which is equal to 200 joules. So that means the amount of work that we have to do in order to tip it like this is equal to 200 joules. So choice number A is the correct answer.